Good afternoon, everyone. I'm just going to give you, um, let you know that I made two gifts recently. One was for my pastor who celebrated his 26 years of ministry and 50th birthday, which is, will be um, this the 25th of this month. And what I did prior to giving it, presenting it to him on Sunday, I made a quilt. And I'll have pictures at the end of this video or in between this part right here. Any pushing forward. So what I did is, where did I get the fabric? I made a quilt and did this piece, this fabric right here was my inspiration. And I used these colors. This was a border and I don't have the other border color, but, and then this, these two golds were in the quilt. Purple and this leafy green and this blah blue. And the back part of it is burgundy which came out real gorgeous and I'm so proud of that quilt. And also, doesn't have a birthday party on this past Saturday. I didn't attend because I was at my pastor's um, ceremony. ceremony. So what I did yesterday is I went out and bought some fabric and I made her a blanket and two pillowcases. So let me show you what I did. And I just made it this morning. So this is the pillowcases. She's a Raiders fan. I made two. One, two. Real simple and easy for me. Even a novice can do this. But this is a yard and five yard and a quarter fabric so that's what I did with that and then what I did with the rest of the fabric that was on here I put this band on it see all the way across and then because me being me and the creative me I love when I'm creative I got I went on to my um, Microsoft like word and found this shield and I made the shield an applique. And so I applicated it on and then I sewed it around just to make sure that it stays secure. So you can see that it's secure on there. So that's what I made for my cousin for her birthday today, which I'll be taking to my grandmother's house or to her sister's house today. Also, I told you that I made two dresses for myself and I have a picture of them. I mean, I actually have the dresses right now. So, this is the first dress that I made for myself. It has, I used lace as my ruffle, and then I put these two gold buttons right here, and this is a stretch, stretch fabric. And then I made it, and this has pockets on both sides, right here. There's a pocket right here. And this is a stretch like denim suiting fabric. And it's pinstripe, as you can see. And it's really nice, and it complements my curves. And it has a split right here on the side. There's a split right there. And then the other dress that I made, my, uh, friend who works at Joanne told me I should do it like this. So I got this shiny stretch um, fabric, satin with a collar, and I wore this on Saturday. And this is just some black sateen stretch fabric. See, it gives, and it also has pockets on the sides here as well. And I wore this in, when I went to Dallas, I told you that I went to Dallas and I saw a lot of ladies with this type of um, dress on. And the difference between mine and theirs is I made mine. And mine is custom fit for me and no one will ever have this dress. And I can't wait to make more because I went to Joanne's, like I said yesterday, and bought the Raiders fabric to make my cousin her dresses. I mean her, um, her quilt. 
So, um, also, I will be doing two craft shows, two craft shows, one next month, which will be November, excuse me, this is where it's going to be at, November the 20th, which is actually my da dad's birthday. This is what I'll be doing on my dad's birthday, celebrating both of our birthdays. So that's what I'll be doing That's there. And I'm going to be doing another craft show in Novato in December. So if you want to see me, meet me. I'll be at these two locations. And one is in Richmond and one is Novato. And also, I'm so thankful for my gifts. And also what I'm making to go to one of um at the craft shows. And I'm making these cute little fabric coasters. Let me show you what they look like. They're so cute. Got the idea from um my favorite website. I know other people's web favorite website is Facebook and Facebook, Twitter, and MySpace in that order. I have a Twitter account. I do not have a Facebook account because I don't want to be like everybody else because I don't feel like I have to conform to what everybody else is doing because I'm set aside. I don't have to be like everybody else. But needless to say, let me show you what I made. Brick coasters so you can set your drinks on. These are some. And I, when I looked at that, I didn't even realize they had horses. A horse, like, um, jockey stuff on them. Jockey but that's what these look like. And what I did is I have these like this, like that. And then I have one that's, you know, the solid. And the checker is also solid. So this is just one, one, one pack I'm gonna sell. And if you're interested, just let me know. And this is another one. This is really effeminate. These are both that side. And this is the same side. And then this is, then you have this one that's the same on both sides. And then you have these that are all different. And this is just some of the things that I'm working on right now for my craft to sell at my craft shows, craft fairs that I've entered. The blessing with the one I'm doing in Richmond is that I went to the craft show last year and they didn't advertise a lot. So what I've taken on myself is I made some flyers and I'm also putting it on here so you guys can come out and support my my the local craft local local people that do handcrafted items because some people people don't appreciate people like myself who do things by hand. You're more apt to go out and buy something from the store that is mass produced or something that you can find anywhere. These are certain things that you won't find anywhere else but from me. And this is another set that I did, which is real. They're all the same. And they have a gold back. And I have these with the ladies on them. And they're all the same with the checker back. And this is just something that I've done. I'm going to make a couple more. I have a couple more I'm going to make. So this is a solid. <clears throat> and this is a solid. When I say solid, it's on both sides. And this one was on both sides. And then you have this one both of them so that's some of the things that I'm working on right now and like I said if you're interested in any of the things that I've made please let me know and I'll get back to you um, also don't forget to comment rate subscribe and know that God loves you and stay encouraged know that we can do all things through Christ who strengthens us and don't let what someone else's don't let someone else's views dictate how you feel and with that no I end this video. Bye bye. He's pulling me back, me back, telling me I need you in life.